Islam is a fast, it's the yeah. last in the true religion, but it yeah. is the last. Bing one. Chuing? That, that's definitely Chinese, guys. That, that, Bing Chuing. Wallahi, that's Chinese. The first one to use languages as an interview with bad bitches. Told me I was gay before we got in here, just so you guys know. And I'm okay with gay people, but they're not, because they're you're like Muslim, you know, it's like. We offered him iced coffee, but. Uh... Ice coffee, what am I, a white girl? Well, we're trying to fuck you like what after, right? Welcome back to Seeking Success Podcast, number one podcast in Toronto. We're here in Miami. Yes, sir. Beautiful city. We got Marwan in the house. Do I look at this or that? That one, that one. Oh, that one. not you? No. That's weird. Just hey, at, guys. <laughs> dude, do not look at me or Rudy the whole time. It's actually a part of a culture. To, if you look in our, like what you're doing right now, when you look at oh, eyes. Oh, like that? It's uncomfortable? You're me right now. Is it like a Sri Lankan thing? Yeah, oh, so yeah, that's you. Yeah. My bad. Just, just right, keep cool, your eye bad. on the... No, just I'll just look at the wall. Yeah, just, yeah that's perfect. <laughs> time out. Fine, whatever. Fine. Crazy. Okay. We got the man of many languages in the house. Is that's what you're known for? At least one. Yeah, I know. English, English? is a good one. Yeah. English. Yeah, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not so good, brother. Very difficult for uh, me to, you know. I can I can mix accent too. But yeah, I do. Uh, I do a lot of language content. That's what I, it's my thing. Oh, uh, before we even get into this, actually, uh, since it's my podcast, uh, where are you guys from? What's your name? <laughs> my, name's, my name. My name's Umar Khan. Umar Khan. My name's uh, Orlando. So Khan, you know Genghis Khan? Yeah, yeah. You know Didn't one of like, six people are descendants of. Genghis I was Khan? just gonna make that. Yeah, isn't that nuts? Fun fact. Right? You're also Khan. Yeah, I'm also Khan. Uh, so you're. Are you brothers? Uh, cousins. You're actually cousins? Yeah. yeah. Who's older? He's older. I'm older. Nice, the beard, yeah. My little brother's like 20. If you're watching this, shout out. He has a beard, and I don't have a beard. Crazy. I look so Italian. Wait, um, wait where are you from? I'm Tunisian. Tunisia. Tunisia. Where is Tunisia? Come on, guys. Where's that at? Uh, I want to say Africa. Yes. Yeah. But where? Next to what? Uh, fuck. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, near it's, Morocco, maybe? Yes. Yeah? Kind of. It's, near Egypt, it's, no? So you got Morocco, and then you got <laughs> Egypt, and then you got Tunisia in the middle, surrounded by Algeria and Libya. People always say that because people uh, only ever know Egypt and Morocco from like history. Yeah, yeah Tunisia's like a little one in the middle. Wait, are you like Muslim or something? I am Muslim. Yeah, Alhamdulillah. Am. Alhamdulillah. 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 Alhamdulillah, bro. Yeah, I'm not drinking it. I don't have sex outside of marriage and none of that stuff. Just That's haram. Haram, man. haram, bro. Haram. It's a halal podcast, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Change it to halal. What's it called? Seeking what now? Seeking, Seeking halal. Call it Seeking halal. Seeking Islam. Seeking Islam. Crazy. Yeah. It's actually yeah. so Muslim meat. So here's the thing, bro. We do this podcast. We can secretly bring people into folds of Islam. Mm, exactly. So we just get it's, them. it's like a pyramid scheme. Yeah. yeah the bigger pa- caliphate, them. right? You guys work for the caliphate. That yeah. makes sense. Oh, yeah. you know? like, I mean, I would know I'm Arab too. So I guess. we're like the opposite of fresh and fit. Oh, yeah. you're on. We promote disgusting um, and fat. Fresh and fit. Old and fat. That's the opposite. Well, we're of talking about the, po- the fresh fit podcast. Fresh Wait, is that is that the you're using that to describe Muslims? That's like no, I was trying myself myself oh. actually. Um, okay. so fresh and fit backwards is yeah. that makes sense? Yeah. yeah. Cool. Fair. Well, we have fit, and then we have not fresh, and then we have the podcast. That's great. Yeah, yeah. No, it makes sense. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Fair. So, how many languages do you actually know at a surface level? Twenty at a service level, as in like you know you could like I'm sure you're not fluent in all these languages. No, I, of course not. No, and I, I will never say that I'm fluent in all of them. I, I can speak I can speak twenty six of them. I'm fluent in six. Can of them. Can you name all twenty six? No, I forget. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I forget. Okay, Sometimes so I forget. Like the, Wait, the, hold on. More importantly, why? Why, why did you learn why these I know so many languages? Dude, I as a kid, I was always no so basically. To be honest, yeah. <laughs> so I was. I'll tell you this. I was living in France, in Paris, right? Okay. And I was. I don't know French aussi. Pas français, couramment. Bien sûr. Tu viens de Montréal. Comme si comme ça. Je t'ai né à Montréal. Tu t'es à Montréal. Tu t'es né à Montréal. Oui. T'as pas l'accent québécois. Oui. T'as pas l'accent québécois. Mais c'est pas l'accent québécois. C'est comme ça plutôt qu'on parle le québécois. Mais c'est pas l'accent francophone. Bah voilà, tu vas bien. Je ne sais comprends pas. Comme ça, tu quoi? Oh, would you rather speak um, Urdu? Yeah. Can you say Hoap? Crazy. Oh, Hyderabad. 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 Wow. Eh, ab ke naam kahe? You said Umran and Omar. Omar. Mera naam Marwan hai. Mera naam Marwan hai. Yeah. If you see cute girls, be like, "Khub surat." Like, jeez. I got a lot of PR for you. Yeah. Jeez, jeez. Crazy. Actually, my boy. Shukriya, bye. Jeez. Shukriya, bye. Bro, you know what's so sad? You speak better Urdu than me. Urdu. Yeah. I thought it was Hindi. Or, well, I can't say that because you're Pakistani. I'm not, I'm not from India. Oh, then I am allowed to say yeah, that because yeah, you're, yeah. you're Hindi? Hindi. Or Urdu. Makes both. You, you get, no, but like your religion is Hindu. Oh, no, I'm Muslim. I'm Muslim. You're Muslim? Yeah. I thought that all, well, honest question, I thought that all Indians that were Muslim were Pakistani. No, so. Pakistan they, and India. Just like when well, the war happened, right? Yeah, when the yeah. war happened, a lot of the Muslim people fled India to go to Pakistan. Right. But a lot of Muslims were left behind. Really? Yeah. What well, yeah, is yeah. like two billion people? Yeah. So I'm yeah. sure someone got left behind. Eh, okay. It's kind of hard not Yo, to. It's fast growing religion as well. So it is. Probably... It actually is. Islam yeah. is a fast. It's the yeah. last in the true religion, but it yeah. is the last one. I feel, like a, I feel like a goddamn. I'm not trying to convert people. I'm just saying <laughs> the facts. All right. I trust me. I'm American at this point. Just relax. Yeah, 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 but yeah, yeah. yeah, that is that's a pretty cool fact. Actually, yeah. where was I going with this? What other languages do you speak? <sighs> you got to name one. Uh, do you speak uh, Punjabi? Tore ondi tu
are English, Arabic, French, Italian, Portuguese, and Spanish. The other ones... Italiano. Oh, and, what's that? Italiano. Posso parlare anche italiano. Ah, bellissima. Come hai imparato? Ah, uh, fucking Radice. What? Radice? You told my name, right? Radice. Radice. But that's a, you're Italian. Uh, uh, Radicio. Radicio? Oui. Why do you have an si. Italian name? Oui. Si. Why do you have an Italian name? I don't, my name's Radice. That's but it. if I was Italian, it'd be Radicio. Oh, when I told you guys I was a little lit before I got on here, my brain's kind of like... So no, like it's okay. I was going to be like, Sri Lanka, you should be Portuguese because they were calling <laughs> us by the Portuguese... Okay. But yeah, those ones. And then I know a bunch of really random ones like, I don't know, like Farsi, Swedish, oh, no Greek, uh, Kimrog, Gaelic, Dutch, Gaelic German. Gaelic is crazy too. Yeah, it's weird. Call us a tall too. Pog Mahal. I don't know why I know that You one. know what Gaelic is? It's like what they speak in like, uh, was it Scotland or Ireland? Ireland. Ireland, yeah. Ireland. Ireland. Yeah. Well, parts of... Wait, can you say something in that language? Like just a, like... A, what, in Gaelic? A, yeah, in like a sentence. Pog Mahon. Does that mean fuck you? It means kiss my ass. Okay. Uh, there's also uh, Ka- Karas Ottomditch. What's your name? Kadis Adam Ditch, and you would say uh, like your name, then Adam Dam. Umaria Amadan. Umari. Say it again. Umaria Amadan. Umari. Umar. Anam Dam. Anam Dam. Anam Dam. Reese Anam Dam. Marwan Anam Dam. Kadis Adam Ditch, and you could say Pog Mahan. Kadis Atatu is how are you? Uh, I don't know why. I just know like bits and sentences yeah, yeah, yeah. and like, things, that's especially ones cool. like that where no one speaks except for people that are from there. Like that's my favorite thing. The best story I have is when I went to, you know, Rwanda, like the Rwandan genocide yeah. back in the 90s. Yeah. Was it 90s? 80s? 90s? I don't know. I forgot. But I go there and I'm, I'm a white guy. Okay. Rwandans are black. I go there and I can speak Kenya Rwanda. And the look on these <laughs> guys' faces, we're just like, why the fuck do you guys <laughs> run this podcast? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why the fuck do you speak my language? And they're like, what? And I had these glasses in my pocket. They're the uh, Ray-Bans. Oh, these the these glasses. They got the yes, cameras on. Yes. So I got all these clips of me. They had no idea I was filming. Yeah, yeah, so I'm just yeah. walking into a store and be like, Mura koze chani musansa wanje. TikTok ke kushi misha. And they're like, what the fuck is going on? Like, why? Like, who are you? Yeah. I'm like, I'm like are, you a, are you a Tutsi? Which is like a horrible joke to make because if you know the Rwanda genocide, it's the Hoodoos and the Tutsis. And oh. But Tutsis were typically whiter. So there are some light skin Rwandans. They thought I was one of those. And I'm like, dude, I'm white. Like, I'm not at all Rwandan. So it's, it's moments like that that I like to learn languages and like realize that, you know, the world kind of can become a smaller place when you can realize that you can befriend someone quickly by doing that. Fair. And when I was a kid, yes, I didn't have that many friends traveling around. And I had my dad, who I love my dad with all my heart. I was going to get happy for a second, but I, I fucking love my father. He knew nine languages oh, wow. when I was like way younger. And I would see the look that people would put on their faces the second that he could like speak their language. We would be in Germany. And he'd be like, speak in Germany, these guys. And I'm like, well, how do you do that? Like you're Tunisian. How do you, you know? Mm. And I was also in an international school. And there's a story I had when I was, I think I was in Tunisia at the time and I was at a resort and there was a bunch of German girls, like I was like what, 11 or 12. And I was like, dad, I want to go party with them. Like, I want to go hang out with them. I want to like be their friend. He goes, oh, just go to them and say, spielen zusammen. I'm like, what the hell does that mean? It means let's play together. And I didn't know any German. I walk up and I go, spielen zusammen. They were like, oh, this is can do it. Can't just fucking do it. And I had no idea what they were saying, but then I just kind of threw a ball up and we became friends. And I'm like, Languages can connect people. Wow. Sure. Like it's literally moments like that to where you're like, oh, I can't talk to this person. I can't make a connection here. I can't travel to this country. I can't talk to that really pretty girl. But if you speak their language, you can. Mm. So that was wow. always my key to like doing that. And then I just became older and I got really better and I traveled a lot more and I got better at picking up languages. And then I realized now that I'm the guy that's the go-to to how can I talk to that person in their language? And now we do that. That's wow. actually so fucking Wait, okay. Yeah. And so it was genuinely you just learned these languages what before you travel to a country you I pick knew, it up? well no so my biggest tip of learning a language is traveling okay okay like when you spend time in a country you read every sign you hear how it sounds because I learn phonetically I have a course and yes I will plug my course languagelord.com but if you go there you can but it, if you don't pay us it's getting censored that's what I'm saying. <laughs> do not pay them any ad reels on that but um, one of the things I explained is the travel part of it so okay. like if you go somewhere if you read the signs and you learn phonetically learning phonetically is everything you will not learn from Duolingo. You will not okay. learn from reading. So here's the crazy thing. So, okay, in Canada. Yeah. Okay, how, and I don't know if it's like this in America too. How would you guys say the ABCs phonetically? ABCs? Yeah. What do you mean? Exactly. A, B, C. Like, are you talking about A, B, C? No, 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 no. Like the way the letter sounds. Yeah. It's so more the way it in sounds. In the UK, they have a phonetic way of saying the ABCs. Mm. Like, like do, you, do you know what or no? I don't remember it because like this girl told me and whatever. But bro, I was mind blown. I was like, the Fuck do you mean phonetically? I'm like, I, I, just, I'm, I literally did what you did. She was like, oh, how do you say the ABCs phonetically? And I'm like, what do you mean like A, B? And she looked at me like I was retarded. I look, look at you right now that I'm retarded. I don't understand what you mean. Doesn't <laughs> I, phonetics I mean like, retard, so. I, I was did. born one and I became one even harder when I turned 12. 
But phonetically, when I say that, I mean like don't look at the way. Th- For example, here's what's mind blowing about English. Say enough. Enough. How does the end of that word sound? An F. Up. Yeah. Now say you know like phishing emails. Yeah. yeah. Phishing okay, emails. Phishing with an F. Yeah. And then say the word fish. Fish. Flamingo. Why does the GH, the PH, and the F all sound the same? Enough. Fishing. Flamingo. Proof. G, H, P, H, and F. Like they're all completely different synonyms, completely yeah. different cognates, yeah. but they sound the exact same. That is phonetics. Mm-hmm. That uh-huh. is learning about how the word sounds, not how it's spelled, yes. not how it's used, but how it sounds to your ears. Uh-huh. So I, I cannot read Russian. I cannot read Greek, but I can speak it yeah. because I can, I don't learn it by reading it. I don't learn it by writing it. I learn it by pronouncing it, mm. by hearing it, mm. by thinking this word must sound this way in my head. Yeah. Therefore, when I go to write it, like yeah. if I say, Mila oligo elenica, elenica, those letters, like I can't write, yeah. but I can pronounce them. And if I go to write them in English, you know, then I'll just write them in the English words. But like, it's phonetics. It's phonetically how they sound. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, what tips would you give? So, we're here in Cuba. Cuba. We're here. We are here in right Cuba. Now. Sorry, Fidel. <laughs> There's a lot of Cubans down here, there and uh, I'm actually going to go to Cuba next month. Okay. You actually going to Havana? Yeah. Uh, not Havana. We're going to fuck. I can tell you what the island. It's about an hour away from there. It's some resort. Okay? Santiago. I think so. Uh-huh. I think so. What language do they speak primarily there? Spanish. 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 Of course. Okay. So, what tips would you give for me to pick up a little bit of Spanish before I get there? Well, you're in Miami. We're basically in Cuba right now. <laughs> I would honestly spend more time talking to people. Like when you you were at a like Target beforehand, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. I bet the people that work there spoke Spanish. Oh, for sure. So don't don't like just talk to them. Be like, hey, what do you call us? How do you, oh, mucho mucho gracias, right? Como como like just start como to try como. to speak uh, using your own knowledge. They will say it to you. They'll say you say it like this, say it like this. Then it's all recall. Uh, I remember they told me it sounds like this, and then remember that they said that, uh, and then use that. And then if you want it, write it down. However you are, if you're a kinetic learner, if you're a phonetic learner like I am, if you're an active learner, if you're a writing learner, if you're a visual learner, depending on your learning style, just get the actual tips on how to speak something from the mouth, like the horse's mouth. Get them to say it. Don't try to read it. Don't try to write it. Don't try to type it. Speak to people. Mm -hmm. Get them to say it to you. Get them to pronounce it to you. Then you pronounce it like them. And that's that's the best way to do it. Okay. So, and here's a dope thing. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you might know this because you teach this, but uh, I play a lot of VR. Like virtual okay. reality, like porn. And, no, not. <laughs> yeah, I play a lot of that. The Oculus, shout out Oculus. You know the vibes. Crazy, but like they have like these apps now where like the same thing you're saying to teach you mm. language, but now you're in an environment, a cafe, for example, and then like you gotta talk to them, and you mm. can't progress in the game until you. Wait, speak. they have that? Yeah. I'm going out of business, man. Yeah, I, I lost. <laughs> yeah. I mean, what, if you PS, I'll censor that part out. <laughs> no, oh. lit- that's that. They actually have a game like that. Yeah, I, I haven't played it just yet. But like, as you talk about, it, I'm like, yo, fuck, it'd be really cool to go to Cuba and start talking in fucking Spanish. Yeah. Maybe spend some time in the metaverse. You could just go and find a really cute um uh, Cuban girlfriend, and then ha- like make her really mad. She'll yell at you in Spanish. Just uh, remember what she's saying. Puta, hey, puta ya huevo, get that. Like just like you'll fair, understand it really fast. Yeah. Fair, fair. You learn about my huevo means fair. to piss off a Dominican. You learn about that means to piss off an Argentinian. What's that? Pendejo. We learned Pendejo. that. Pendejo. Girl came here and called us that actually. Did she actually? Yeah, was she, she bad? No is she problem. here? Not bad. Beautiful. Oh, but like, but it's like America talk. Like you're Canadian, right? Yeah. No, no, we like, said that too. You, just, you say she's she bad. She's just retarded. Oh, we don't say beautiful here. That's weird. We just say Linda or Mama Sita. Hermosa. Hermosa. Yeah. Do you speak we don't. Chi- Go ahead. No, I'm scared now. Do you speak Chinese? Wo hui zhong wan. Wo jin dai ye shui di nian. In dao la. In dao. Bing chuing. That that's definitely Chinese, guys. That, that Bing chuing. Well, I hear Chinese. I know Bing chuing is ice cream. Ice cream. Yeah. Yeah. I hate that John Cena meme. Yeah, that's I <laughs> <laughs> chilling. Good morning, China. I love ice cream. That that's just why is that a sound bit? I love that sound bit. What about like Japanese? Oh, it's the same thing. The Japanese that I know. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. It, it, it is pretty actually different. You'd be surprised. No, like, no, no, like they're all like 100%. they sound the same, but they are all so fucking different. It's crazy. crazy. Korean, Japanese, Cantonese, Mandarin. Oh, Korean. They sound oh, the same, but they are not. Bro, the same. can you give us like the fucking Japanese like anime like? Yeah. Oh my, what more shin do you do? Nani? They go like that. <laughs> Nani? No, because I used to watch a lot of anime. Oh my, what more shin do means now you die or you're already dead, uh, and then Nani means what? Uh, like what? You got like kawaii, like a really cutie, and then hello? you got like Nani. Do like, kawaii desu. Oh, I just see, yeah, like you're really cute. Do you watch a lot of anime? Used to. Fair. I play a lot of League of Legends. Hentai? I play a lot of League Still. Hentai. Still. I was actually in one. I thought this was going to be what that was. Soon. But then it wasn't. Oh, is it soon? This is just a plot. But the actors in the back? Yeah. And they come out. Can one of them be at least be like light skinned? Because I'm into that. All right, thanks. They're two black um, dudes. Yes. Yeah, yeah this is Huge. Sort of a blacked ex brown. You guys ever heard that song, Ram Ranch? No, that's a go. Don't play it. Do not play it as a sound bit right now. Cut. 
Great song. Great song. Crazy. Is that your song? No, but I could play it for a second if you want. He wouldn't want me to do that. No, no, no. It's pretty bad. It's okay. A, How the fuck did you get to Miami, bro? <laughs> How Why did I get here? here? Yeah. Why are you here? I, it's hot. To be honest, I have my best friend who you might have all seen on TikTok. His name is Eric Ronaldo. He is a. He's the oh, guy. Yeah. He's like the he Spanish dude. On yeah. on my on on Miami's team, right? Or or Ronaldo. No. Sorry, Saudi Arabia. Ronaldo. Is that what Cristiano? Yes, Ronaldo? like. Sí. Yeah, 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 that's Cristiano that's Ronaldo. Friend? Yeah, yeah, that's my friend. Oh, yeah. sick. But you know Drake too, right? Oh, because you're course. from Toronto. Yeah. Can you bring him on like next time? Oh, for sure. Why am I hearing like, like someone getting fucked next door? <laughs> Literally, do you hear that? I think there's two black guys warming up in there. <laughs> are you serious? You are. You guys hear that, right? Like I have great hearing. Like I'm here, like stop, and I'm like, oh shit. Okay. Anyways, um, that's the next person on the podcast. Um, I didn't get that treatment though, sadly, because I showed up. Crazy. Late. Um, what was I saying? <laughs> so Eric, Eric was a really good friend of mine. We're both from Virginia. Okay. Um, and I was like, ah, oh, TikTok's like whack. Like I would never want to do that. I have a nine to five. Like I mean, at the end of the day, I work for the UN. So I, so that's like what my main thing was. And the United I was, Nations. Yeah. Okay, we're Doing going to what? that. Oh, we'll go into that. Let me finish the story. Okay. Shh. That's work. You know, they say like, I'm a consultant. What's that? I, I'm a consultant. <laughs> I consult. <laughs> I do consulting. Uh, so stuff like that, basically. Fair. But uh, what was I saying with this? Oh, so he was like, yo, do you want to go to Miami? Because what we used to do is it was COVID. Virginia sucks. We really kind of go down to Florida a lot because it was kind of open, you know, and we could have fun still. The weather was nice. And Virginia is kind of dreary, especially like most of the year. So I made a lot of trips down here. He always wanted to do content. And I was there for him, filming for him when he was like, like not even a creator. Now he has like millions of followers. Like, you think I have followers? The guy's double what I have. Mm. Um, and, and he's super, you know, super Virginia in the sense where like he's not a Miami guy. Mm. So we decided we'd come down together. I'm like, yeah, I can work remote. I'll just work remotely here and I'll go film for you, whatever. And it's also Miami. Like it's lit. Like it's awesome. You guys know, like it's a lit Vibes. fucking place to be at. Vibes right there. Um, then over time, um, you know, I was like, we'll go down for a couple of months. We ended up staying for a lot longer. And then he was like, yo, Marwan, like, why don't you do content? And I'm like, no, that's gay. I'm like, no, why, why the hell would I do that? Like, you, you can do that, but I got a job. My dad will kill me if I ever don't have a job. And one day he just points the camera at me and I'm, I'm a little bit lit. And he goes, yo, just ask these girls, like, what their favorite language is. Because you like, I already knew like a couple, like five or six. Um, and he was like, ask what their favorite language is. So I do. And I ask their favorite languages. They say their favorite languages and I recite those languages in the videos. And they go, oh, wow, like, no way. I was the first guy to do that. Not the first guy to do language content because there are a bunch of other guys that do the POV stuff. Yeah, yeah. But the first one to use languages as an interview with bad bitches. Yeah, like yeah. I was the first one to coin that. And I'm like, that is a whole niche that has not even been explored yet. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. And that was just me thinking about it. Like maybe this might go viral. I posted it for fun. Yeah. The next day it had like 4 million views. Crazy. And it was On reposted. First video. first video. What the like fuck? Like it was posted Crazy. everywhere. Like I was getting retagged and I had like 80K followers after a day. And I'm like, I guess I'm a TikToker now. And I just never stopped since. And now the momentum is built up so much that like I get recognized in Rwanda and in Malaysia and shit. And how long have you been doing this for? Crazy. A year and a half. Wow. Like a year and a half, yeah. So in a year Pretty and a half, you basically got half a million followers. A year and a half. Or maybe more I, with this so Instagram. On, yeah, on IG, it's like, it should be at like 500 by, by June. And then TikTok, almost at a million. If wow. I count in Facebook, Snapchat, YouTube, I'm about four, four point five million now. All my socials, and which obviously, is wild. you don't work for UN anymore. You do this full time. Just full time, yes. Solid. That's, yeah. Do you do all this independently, or do you like have a management team? Uh, depending on my platform. If I have like like my Snapchat, I got a guy doing that. My Facebook, I got I got a guy doing that. My Instagram has always been like like my Instagram is where I like have like my old friends, so like I kind of have like my close friends where it's like sure. yeah, people follow me, but like I don't really decide on your girls. You don't want them seeing that. Yeah, like, basically. All the dick pics. Yeah, I, I put them in the general inbox, not yeah. like the primary. Yeah. So it's kind of like you know, like if I go way back, I got my old like my things from like you know back in 2004 when yeah. i was five years old um, but yeah <laughs> yeah i know i was eight i was eight okay and wait so how, how are you monetizing like the language content like is it just through ad revenue well of course i told you i have this course so the course is how, how's the course performing like it's selling well it's doing well it's doing well so what's the members uh well it's not so much a membership so Honestly speaking, and this is like true advice, I don't think that a course, so the reason I made the course was because a lot of people asked me, like, it was twofold. They're like, one, you're pretty funny. Like, you have this level of confidence where you can talk to people. Mm -hmm. And I grew up super shy. But when I told you that, back to the beginning of the clip, like, the reason I gained so much confidence talking to people was because of my, the tips my dad gave me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Speak their language. Yeah. Like, just be quippy. Be yourself, but speak their language. Connect with them on a different level. Yeah. So I realized, okay, I personally never... You you're good, you're good, you're good. I, I don't I want I, I gotta pay extra if you want me to do that. Yeah, you're good, you're That's good. a little um I can get that girl to do it. Um <laughs> dude, I have ADD, so like whenever I go on tangents, I get so bad at going back to my point. God right. damn it. Um what was What's I saying? For you? Your yeah, dad taught you. My dad taught oh so so he he like let me know that like um or rather he showed me 
that if you're able to really just connect with them on a language on a linguistic level, it's so much more performance, you know, eccentric in the sense where it's like, okay, I'm able to not only connect with them as a person, but like based off their own culture, like I speak their language, like, where are you from? You're Iranian. Do you speak Iranian? No, I don't. You mean Farsi? Oh yeah. Okay. That's great. Like, why do you know more about my culture than I do? Why do you speak my language better than I do? Like the same way you were like, why is your Urdu like yeah, yeah. level of mine? Right. It's like yeah. nuts. Um, but just doing that is a level of respect. And yeah. a lot of countries is like that. Very few are not like that. One of them is France. When you go to France and you're like an English guy, like American guy, and you try to speak French, they'll be kind of like, oh, I speak English, you know? Like they're, they don't like that. And you go to Italy, the same thing. Like there's some countries that are like that. But back to my point, <clears throat> and, and one of the things that I stress on my course too, it's not, it's, I'm not teaching you French. I'm not teaching you Russian. I'm teaching you how to learn any language you want mm. because there are tips that I have that'll help like the same, like travel more, learn phonetically, use power words, things like that. Um, and, and, you know, the success of the course isn't so much of, are there members in there actively, you know, practicing? Because I do have a Discord where people that have bought the course and go and practice amongst themselves. Because I have people from all over the world that follow me, all that want to learn English, want to learn Spanish, want to learn Arabic. And really one of the main things I stress is converse with people. Like I gave you guys that advice, like go talk to people, learn phonetically. Someone uh -huh. knows a language that you know, communicate on the level that you can, speak the language that you can with them. And a lot of it's traveling. A lot of the course, um, the things that are stressed on there are not so much like, Je suis tu et il a, like you're not you're not gonna learn French by doing that. Yeah, you're yeah, really yeah. not gonna learn French by doing that. You're gonna learn. Which I, by the way, I have that stuck in my head from when I was a kid. Yeah, je yeah, suis yeah. tu et il a. Je yeah, t'en. Yeah. Je peux free like Champs Elysees. And I'm like, I didn't learn anything doing that. I learned way more just going to France and like going to Germany and like and like going to Russia. Like, mm -hmm. which by the way, sorry Putin for what happened last time. Um, okay, but yeah, it was uh, it was it was very it was very eye opening in the sense where I I'm probably the only person that could make a course about this because. I'm the only one that got it like that. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. not got it like that, but like, I understood it like that. I understood that it's not courses. It's not yeah. vocabulary. It's not only I mean, vocabulary, yes, but it's mostly just learning phonetically, learning the basics. Uh -huh. Learn the basics, how to talk, learn power words, learn about what the words are you're going to most likely to use. Then after that, you just put in some vocabulary and then you realize, okay, I put them all together. Now I can speak this language. Oh. Boom, just like that. So, yeah. so back to the question, how much money are you making with the course? Uh, $5. <laughs> you sell for $5? Yeah. Is that a one-time payment? No. I'm kidding. I think it's like $100. Oh, okay. 100 US dollars. Yeah. But it's like 15 different modules. Um, I don't know. I've made a good... I, I don't ever like to talk too much about money on a podcast. Full respect. But I, I, I do well. I do well on it. But my main thing isn't so much to make money from it. It's more to just... I, I don't know. The same way that I was able to like make a lot of friends and make a lot of success with my own ability. I have a lot of people that hit me up that have no money. Yeah, yeah. Like, bro, what tips you have? I'm not gonna be like, go buy my course. I'll be like, yeah. here are my tips. Like, sure. Like, I gain nothing. I, I lose nothing by being nice. Yeah. And you'll go tell someone, oh, I learned from this guy, and then it's, it's word of mouth at that yeah, point. Yeah, you know, yeah, I've yeah, yeah. given my course to a lot of a lot of people for free. Just going like, bro, learn French. Like, like, bro, I'd love to. I got this one guy who I was actually following for a while, and he's a pretty big TikToker, and I was like a big fan of his. He DM'd me, and and like he does language stuff. He's like, bro, how did you learn all these languages? I was like, I'm trying to do that too. And I'm like, Crazy. bro, I just take my course. Like, if you can have it, like, just go. You know, like. Go look at what my material is. Like, yeah. I, I, I want I, the same success I had in the same way that I was able to make a, a buttload of friends and make a lot of connections at a time when I really needed it. Like, when I was younger, and like everyone had like a hard time in middle school. I had an especially hard time in middle school. I was traveling around all the place. My dad was always working in different countries. I never really had like one high school, never really had like one group of friends. So, like, I was like, I kind of have to find a way to befriend anyone no matter where I am. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, languages yeah. got me there because I was able to be so secure and do that. And it made me way happier. I'm like, it's not something I can withhold from people. Yeah, so like, yeah, I have a course if you want to really get into the details about it. But like, if you ask me for advice, like that's my advice. Like do what I say here. I talk about it on my story all the time. In my videos, I talk about how I learn so many languages all the time. When people walk up and ask me for it, just tell them because why withhold that? I and, I and this is one thing I hate. And it's going to sound messed up because I'm a TikToker. I hate TikTokers that monetize their skills. I hate it. I didn't want to make the course. I didn't want to. But then I, I'm like, oh, my dad could use it. My mom could use it. You know, like I could, I could do a lot of things with this. I might as well do something. But at the sure. end of the day, that's not why I do it. I, the ad revenue on most of my reels is also like a good, nice little side hustle. But Wait, on your reels? Yeah. Like Facebook reels, like my shorts, my Instagram reels, like stuff like that. You make money on reels? No, because in Canada, what's it called? You don't make money on Instagram. The only oh, because you guys are Canadian. Yeah, yeah. yeah, the only platform we make money off of oh, is wait, YouTube. I thought you talked about that. Okay, so sure. fuck you, Trudeau. Sorry. Yeah, for real. Yeah, yeah, fuck fuck's you, sake. Yeah, I guess we're moving here. Fuck, Honestly, you, know. you should. Fox you want to make money. The American dream is very much alive. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Eh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So obviously, we don't. Wait, sorry. Is American dream? Sorry. Is American ex is America dream exclusive to Miami? <laughs> no. Fuck you, your Miami. Way, effect, bro. It's way easier. It's way easier here. <laughs> is the Miami Yo. effect real? Yeah. Yeah. I know it 
this. Right. Even me, I'm, I'm like literally, like literally not even the same. Like literally, like now that I'm Cuban, like literally. But bro, I don't like, believe you don't got no jewelry. New jewelry? Oh, I, I thought I was here to get, you know, like like Fact. a porno. You don't really wear jewelry in that. Sorry, I don't have a richer mirror than a Rolex like you. My apologies. I have socks though. They're nice. Kind of dirty from last night. Yeah, got, got a bit dirty. Anytime, man. <laughs> but yo, I want to ask you. So obviously without showing your numbers, what's like the rough like CPM or on reels? Like what if you get like a million views? How much are you making off? So that? I'd say, well, you mean on IG? Yeah. It's not that good. I mean, it's like, I think if you get a million, it's like a hundred bucks. Oh, okay. It's decent. But like the other platforms monetize way more. So if you go to like YouTube, <clears throat> depending on if it's long or short uh, format. For sure. I think short is like a dollar for every 4,000. And I think that long format, it's like a dollar for every thousand. So like 4,000 versus a yeah, thousand. Yeah, yeah. So well, you'll, you'll make more. And all that stuff, it's harder yeah. to get um, long format views. Um, yeah, other platforms, depending on what creator funds you're in, what beta funds you're in, like what real plays you got, what bonuses you got, it varies per creator. And it also varies per month. So like I can, oh shit, I can't even give you like a real number. Like it changes all the time. Oh, for sure. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Especially for short form content, the advertising is so much different than long form YouTube, right? You play ad before, middle, and you know, I'm just so curious because, yeah, like we talking, everyone's been asking us, like, oh, yeah, like you guys making fucking, because we have a couple clips that, you know, do pretty well, whatever, mm-hmm. like a couple mills. They're like, oh, yeah, you guys are making all, all this money from the reels. And we're like, no. 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 Put it on TikTok. It, TikTok pays the most. We don't have that either. You're not allowed to? Nah, just, just YouTube. That is so whack. Just YouTube. That's actually so whack. Uh, I have so many creator friends that are overseas that are like in Australia, Canada. They're like, or not, like England. They're like, yeah, we don't get paid. We do brand deals. I'm like, yeah, <laughs> sucks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God bless America. <laughs> and the only problem too is like if you're relying on brand deals, your brand has to be very brand friendly. You just uh, make a homophobic remarks. Um, of course. I would never. Cut that out right now or cancel this podcast. <laughs> just so you know. Holy shit. He told me I was gay before we got in here, just so you guys know. And I'm okay with gay people, but they're not because they're you're like Muslim, you know, it's like, which Holy I am too. Shit. Which I am too, which is weird, you know, that's why we don't get along. Yeah, crazy, crazy. So what are your thoughts on the whole Israel-Palestine war? Ah, free Palestine. Free Palestine, man. You see what happened last night? Correct answer. Huh? You see what happened last night? Uh, yeah, in Rafa. Yeah, yeah. Man, yeah. Was... I definitely did not want to go down this path, but like, if you want to talk about it, I will. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, I mean, I'm Tunisian. A lot of the very few Tunisians that don't support Palestine. That's fucking terrible. Wait, you I mean, said uh, you're what? One of the Tunisian. Vi- Tunisian. What did you say? You're very, one of the few what? I said there are very few Tunisians that do not support. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, because it's. I mean, there's a big connection to two countries. Like a lot of Arab countries support them. For sure. But it's also hard to support a nation that does things that we saw last night for whatever prerogative it is because at the end of the day all death is bad mm-hmm. for sure. and if you're actively doing it and beheading children like how can you imagine be some people to support you mm. I'll, I'll make another good example like when you look at actually really good example is this one when we think about indigenous people's day in america who was in america before the europeans got here natives the natives right despite who was there before them they were still physically and actively there. They still were living there. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. they're from there, you could say. Like, aren't you guys from Canada? Sure, yeah. You're from, yeah. were you born yeah. in Canada? Yeah, we yeah. So you're a Canadian. Who's to say that you're not? Yeah. I, a foreign entity can't come in and be like, get out, you're not Canadian. You're yeah, like, yeah. go back to Sri Lanka. We'll be like, what the fuck? Like, <laughs> I don't want to. It's expensive, it's far. <laughs> no, you know what I mean though, right? Yeah, like, yeah. like it logically doesn't make sense. And I, and I never want to get too political about it, but I do have what I believe in. I have what I stand by. But um, nowadays, I mean, people get too poli- 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 politi- politicized, oh, politicized, politicized on stuff like that, and it's 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 hard to politicize lives. Mm. I, you cannot politicize lives. I don't care. I don't care what side it was. If people dying, I don't want no one to die. That's my standpoint on it. But. Fair. Well, earlier you talked about how you do uh, accents and like impressions. What's like your best impression? Oh, uh, I like this, dude. This is funny because I do this on dates, <laughs> like. Like, it, oh, well, well, we are going to fuck you yeah, up. Yeah, no, that's what I'm saying, but I mean, that's the whole point, right? I am getting paid $7, aren't I, to be here? Come on now. I got free water, by the way. Tap water. It's my favorite. Uh, that's how you know it's bougie. It's bougie. Number one podcast in Toronto. Here's some tap water. Bleh, bleh. Yeah, we, we offered him iced coffee, but... Uh, iced coffee? What am I, a white girl? Well, we're trying to fuck you like one after, right? That's so. fine. No, you like white girls? I don't even... No offense. My type is Latinas. Sorry, white girls. I mean, you, you know, back in the day, you were valid, but anyway. Um, anyways, unless you want me to DM me right now. At marijuana. What was I saying? Okay, so the question was accents and uh, impressions. Yes. Impressions. I can do countries, or I can also do like. Oh, I love I love doing a a Nigerian one. Oh, God. my best friends in college were like all soccer players. Like some, uh, they were all from Nigeria, like Lagos, Abuja. They always you go like scammers. <clears throat> huh? You mean scammers? Yes. No, no, no. The princes. Okay. The princes. Oh, the princes the Nigerian princes. princes. They always go like. What, what, what? I gotta like turn it on. What? 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 
What, 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 what do you mean? Why are you going over here? You're, you're going to tell me you're going to buy the Jordan shoes for what? Like, like Jesus died for your sins and you want to buy the Jordan shoes? What did he do for you? You're being a delinquent. <laughs> it makes no sense. I don't understand. Like you're being very difficult for me right now. Like they always just sound like it's very. Sorry, bro. I just like the shoes. <laughs> it's very, it literally, it's like very eloquent words, but like with a funny accent. Yeah, 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 yeah. And like you also get like the, the Arabic, like, brother, what are you doing here today? Now, brother, we're going to make the podcast with these guys. They're offering me the Bebzi. You're going to have the party after, but they're telling me the babarazzi are outside because they can't eat the peas. The, the babarazzi is the outside and they're going to make like the boom, 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 <laughs> like this, you know? Very difficult for me. My father, he don't like too much, but it's normal for me. That was not a good one. Okay, oh, well, I have an idea. Let's play a game, okay? So you're going to be an Indian scammer. You're oh going to call me and you're going to try and get money out of me, okay? We're going to roll. Okay, okay, okay. Okay? All right. Uh, hello, who's this? <laughs> I'm, I'm the scammer, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, who's this? <clears throat> hello, brother. Uh, <laughs> It sounds so fucked up. How did it? There was go. Okay, brother. Brother, today you're going to buy the hot doggy, right? I think it's Russian now. No, no, no. Brother, listen to That's me. That's not Indian. You want to have the hot doggy, right? Yes. Don't, 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 don't be, don't be difficult. You're being difficult right okay, now. Bad, don't, don't, don't be like that. Okay. You're being very difficult right now. Sorry. Okay. Uh, brother, do you have a car? I do have a car. Yes. Okay, brother, do you have a? How do you say car in Indian? Carry. Carry. Um, brother, your car. <laughs> Why is that so fast? Brother, you are car. I, I'm not gonna lie. I don't actually have a very good Indian accent. Yeah, okay, that's good. Yeah, yeah, mine, yeah, mine, mine is, yeah. I could do, I could do like a, a good one. I could do a Russian one. I could do a. What are like your best accents? Beroder. Oh, a good Persian one. Beroder, you want to buy these shoes? Beroder, brother, please. With the okay, BMW. Okay, okay. I'll be a guy ordering a shawarma and you're you, the guy working at the shawarma spot. As a okay, but what shawarma type is it? Um, Fucking, do you guys have like, no, they don't have Osmos here. Osmos? You guys don't have Osmos, do you? What's an Osmos? No, it's a Canadian restaurant. It's a Canadian yeah. thing. It's Canadian. There. Let's just say you're just like a typical corner, like, you know, like a typical, like, family-owned shawarma spot. I'm Some Arab. Over. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice. Ready? Uh, uh, hey, can I get the uh, Tuesday special? Brother, for you, my friend, have Bryce. No problem. Have because you're a brown guy like me, brother. Yeah, yeah, no yeah, problem, yeah. brother. Okay, you want to have which one? Uh, I can have the, the, the chicken one, please. Brother, the, it's not halal. It's not halal? No, because the, the whole place is not owned by the Arabic. They are oh, owned by the Russian, you know? So, so I'm so sorry, brother, but my I also have my daughter. She's halal if you want to have this one instead. Oh, Aziza? I will pay for she everything. She can be my Aziza? She can be your Aziza. This is Farsi. That's Farsi. Farsi is different. Bero there, you want to be a Farsi? We can do this too. Zawja, Zawja. What's that? Zawja, yeah, Zawja. That's wife, wife. wife yeah, wifey, wife. Wifey. Oh, Zawja, okay, okay. wifey type. What's your type? What's my type? Yeah. Uh, I'm not racist. I like all types. But good Middle one. Eastern girls? Good one. What's your type? Uh, <laughs> good one <laughs> for all everyone watching. I don't have a type. No, 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 I, 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 like, I like my uh, Middle Eastern brown skin girls. Really? Yeah. Why is that? I uh, just I don't know. Ow. They have huh? the, the cat stare. You know the death stare. The cat stare. They do. Yeah. They do have that. What about oh, you? What's your type? Strong, independent men. <laughs> been oh, there. Man. Been there. I ain't gonna lie. I've been there. I'm sweating here. It's Miami kinda, effect, kinda, man. It's Miami effect, is. bro. It honestly is. It's all like, those really big, hot Cuban guys the, on the uh, road. Yeah, I know for sure. Yeah, what you said? That's what I, you said it first. You said it before we got here. I you did. said it before you turned yeah, on the you camera. You were like, the "I got room." And you guys just fuck it out real quick, <laughs> bro. Who is next door? Do you actually know them? Who? Whoever's next door. I don't think. I don't actually. Who know. is next door, and why are you being so loud? <laughs> like stroke game week. If you can't hear it all, what were you crazy. crazy. Yeah, but oh Jesus, I'm also really good at doing like um, American president accents. Oh, okay. So oh, yeah. I will play a game. Oh, Donald Trump? I will, I oh, no, no. will speak. Okay, yeah, we'll you guess. gotta guess who it is. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah, okay, 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 okay. okay, I'm not a crook. I promise you, I'm not a crook. Joe Biden. Uh, Joe Biden. Uh, no. Wait, do go again, do it again. George Bush. No. Wait, hold on, man. Go sorry, again. sorry, go again. I promise, I'm not a crook. Obama. No. Fuck. Nixon, I'm not a crook. I don't even know. 19 who that is. Uh, How Canada. old are you guys? 17 and 15. Oh. Yeah. Damn, I thought I was young being 12. Um, no, uh, okay, the next one. Uh, and then that's the thing uh, about Americans. Like, no one understands. Trump, Trump. No, no, JFK. See, George you're uh, being kind of racist because I'm the one guy that's... Obama. Uh, there you go. That's a terrible Obama. Took you a while. Man. Is it? Yeah, sorry, what do you sorry. have? Trudeau? <laughs> <laughs> you want to do Trudeau? I don't even know how he sounds. Don't, he's that irrelevant. Yeah, I don't know how he sounds either. Trump's more like, no one likes you. No one even cares because at the end of the day, like, China sucks. Donald Trump. And no one... Oh, W was me saying Trump at the beginning, the one that gave it away? I said that. <laughs> that's really good, actually. And that's why that's why you're a loser and you have the worst podcast okay, in all of Canada. That one crazy. Was good. That one was good. That no one even likes you. Crazy. Can you do a Joe Biden one? Joe Biden just sounds really tired. <laughs> yeah, all, about all those kids. Yeah, no, I mean, uh, that's the. Sorry, what? Joe Biden. 
Were you talking to Jill, Jill Biden. Biden or me? <laughs> oh, yeah, that makes sense. He just sounds really tired. I was like, look. Oh, oh I love the um, oh, Bill Clinton. Remember, did you see the clip where Bill Clinton kissed that baby? No. He goes, oh, I can't say Wait, anything. how old are you? Me? Yeah. How old do you want me to be? <laughs> That's well, the wrong question. If, if it's for his sexual preference, probably under the age of just 14. Like <laughs> under. Oh, okay. You're in luck. I just turned 12. <laughs> You're good, my man. Yeah, I am uh, 27. Uh, 27, okay. 27, yeah. I'm way too old to be being this immature, but yeah. What, what about, uh, no, nah, man, immaturity nah. has no limit. Hey, I, I said I'm happy about it. <laughs> I said I was upset about it, god damn it. So run the clip back, VAR. Crazy. VAR, okay. VAR. Yo, what about, uh, is there any other, like, characters, like TV show characters, movie characters that you get at impersonating? Uh, I like this game. You, you should keep going. <laughs> I know. It's, uh, you know. I always wanted to do an accent challenge. Like, what the fuck? What the fuck, no, guy? You, you, no, what, you're being a racist guy now. What the fuck you talk about? Filipino? You got to go to buy the, the, the how you say, the, the orange I'll chicken. Vietnamese. Like, oh, you know, Thai. You never been Thai? Thailand? You never been Thailand? No. Tell like this. The what? Lady boys? What the fuck? My favorite, actually. When I go there, I go, what? Yo, oh, I got a hilarious story about Bangkok, by the way. Went to Bangkok, was trying to interview girls on the side of the road, and I go, hey, you're really pretty. Can I ask you for a video? Like, yeah, bro. I'm like, oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> like, this is actually a thing here. And then I'm, later, I'm at the club with my boy, and he's at the dancing on the wall. They're hot. They're actually hot. Crazy. Like, I feel weird saying that, but they're actively like attractive. They're actually attractive. And he's like dancing with this one. And he was like, bro, like I was, you know, when you put your hands on like, like on like their thighs when like they're twerking on you. Okay. And he's like, I went up her leg and there was like a string or like a rope around her leg. And he like, he was like, what's this? And she goes, oh, to hide my dick. <laughs> they, have like their, they have their dick taped to the side of their leg so it doesn't like show in the dress. And I'm like, what the fuck is that, bro? That's crazy. It's like tied. And I'm That's like, crazy. get it tied? Tied. Ah, tied. Land. Tie. land of time. Dude, these guys end up accidentally hooking up with these. It's not accidental. Oh, it's on purpose. <laughs> like even like your boys that went out there? Oh, even me. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Like, uh, uh, I told my I miss you. Dude, so you actually hooked up with a ladybug before? Yes. No. Oh. Crazy. Uh, not that I know of. Crazy. Yo, what not noise do you think they'd make when you should fuck them? <laughs> like guys. What the fuck honestly, is wrong with you? <laughs> just go to Bangkok and find out, bro. Why are you asking me? <laughs> Don't take the word from the horse's mouth. Go there and find out for yourself. Crazy. What are you doing, bro? Have you guys zin, by the way? I love zinning. What is this? What is it's like zins. You don't zin in Canada. What's a zin? It's some sort like of nicotine. Like you a patch? Yes. Can I try one? Yes. I never tried it's one. It's definitely before. not drugs. Kids, don't do drugs. <sighs> I'm what? Arab, so I used to smoke all the time. And I'm trying to get off of it. So, you, know, you smoke cigars? How the nah. fuck do we open this box? You don't. <laughs> you just got to look at it the whole do time. Do I just start sucking on like a vape? You had to eat box. And then just like shit out the pieces. And then, you know. <laughs> Like human centipede. Holy smokes. Holy smokes. You can, can you teach me guys some like Toronto slang. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if you if you, we say like, oh, that's my crody. Or okay, we'll tell you we'll tell you words. Oh, and you gotta you... teach me how to use this. Hmm? I'm trying to get lit with this guy. Okay, and what do, what do I do? I just put it like on my cheek. Right here? Between your lip and your teeth. And the top part? Yeah. Oh, crazy. Wanna try some drugs with me? No, I'm <laughs> good. I mean technically uh, what's it called? Uh, coffee's a drug, it's caffeine. Ow. Wait, what does that make you well, feel? Well, here in Miami. What is that going to make you feel? Looking for the hoochie daddies. Ah. Crazy. <laughs> nice. <laughs> what? Oh, what? Uh, what? So, so, what are some other Toronto slang you guys have? Uh, do you know what crody is? What's a crody? So, like, like broski. Like, oh, that's my crody. Crody. Yeah. It's a really gross word. It, it is. It's grungy. Yeah. Crody. It's it's cause I, it's it's like a crip thing. Yeah, yeah? it's like the crips, you know. It's just saying. But it's not really like that. Like crip blood. Like Cro oh, crip. Crips, yeah. Or like crepes. <laughs> this, this crepe. I thought it meant crepe like French. I was like, oh, that's a food <laughs> thing. Makes no sense. And then you got, so you got crody. What else do you say? Uh, a lie. Femme. Yeah, femme. Femme. What else? What else? Um, I'm cheesed. What, is, what do you think what I'm cheesed means? I'm drunk. No. I'm high. No. I'm eating a pizza right now and I spilled all the cheese on my face. No. Yes. That's exactly what I mean. What are you that's talking what it, about? It's, 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 it convinces otherwise. What's wrong with you? Uh, Defaz. Defaz? Yeah. What is defaz? Like, for example, he went home and gave his wife a defaz. Crazy. A defaz. Yeah. What is a defaz? Like a... A hand job. Nah, like slapping oh. the shit out of someone's mouth. Like, so when you beat someone up. No, nah, just a So when slap. I learned that you beat your wife, second, that that's how you say beat someone up? Chapaz? No, it's like, no, a, it's like, like a actual slap. slap. Like a slap in someone in the face. Like a hot one? Like, oh, daddy, hit me. Well, like, like Will a, Smith hitting um, Chris, 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 Chris Brown. Brown. That was like a defaz. That's a proper defaz. Do you guys think that was real, by the way? Probably not. Low key. I think it was real. I think it was a real slap. Really? No. No, I don't. Oh my God. They're all actors. They're literally all actors. Yeah. Like, you know that, right? It's a, it's like the Academy Awards for actors. <laughs> nothing is real on that. Like, nothing is real on that. Yeah, you're getting a headline. Wait, or no? is the Illuminati real? Uh, what's that? Crazy. I just don't like, I just know languages. 
crazy. Yeah, I'm not allowed to speak on that topic on camera. It's crazy. Because of my... Like, yeah, I would never do that. Why would I do that? It's weird. Anyways, what do you think? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, what's some slang that we have in America? Oh, okay. Uh, let me see if you guys get this. Okay. Bet I'm finna hop in my whip. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna my, go car. In my car. Uh, okay, we're not retards. Well, well I mean, yeah, you, you did say you were retarded. Facts. Um, damn, yeah. what do we even say? You guys know I'm finna, right? I'm yeah, finna. I'm gonna. Let's run it. Yeah, yeah let's, let's go. go. I think it's Toronto um, bikes a lot of other countries. You guys do. Flying. If you guys know all this and you do. What about a uh, um, buddy tried to finesse? Buddy tried no. Try to finesse. Buddy me. tried to fleece me. Like finesse me. Like well, Robbie. I said finesse. God damn it. Huh? Oh. Yeah, it's like buddy tried to fleece me for ten dollars. He tried to like rip me off. Fair. Like fleece me. What if? What if? Um. Okay. So. Oh, he tried to koal me. Koal. Yeah. What the hell is that? Like a koala. Like koal. Jump on you. No. Give you a hug. No. <laughs> like a koala does. I don't. I don't know. What is no, it? Like, like finesse. Oh, he tried to koal. Koal me. me. Yeah. Oh. We say finesse. I'm, I'm, an, I'm an East Coaster. In we the West Coast. Too. Finesse, you guys say cool. tubular? Do you do tubular? No. Tubular? It's well, radical. Tubular like, that's so radical, bro. Oh, no, we don't. It's a West Coast thing. Mm. Tubular is like really cool. Like gnarly. Gnarly. Yeah, gnarly. Dude. Tubular, bro. Like, Saw, dude. serves up, dude. Serves up. Yeah, no way. Wow, I thought I would be doing languages, not so much um, accents from California. Can you do a good SpongeBob impression? <sighs> no, but I can do a really good Patrick Starr one. Okay. The inner annals of my mind are an enigma. No, I don't think that's... That. I think mine's better already. <clears throat> oh, jeez, SpongeBob. Get the fuck out what of here. What the fuck was that? Wait, 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 yo, mine wait. was okay. I don't you know, know what... You know what we were doing? They said we were doing Gary impressions. He doesn't... <laughs> Crazy. I forgot he was a cat. He's not a cat. He's a snail. snail. He's a cat. In that world, he's a cat. He goes meow. <laughs> like, that's a fucking cat. <laughs> He's not a dog, dude. He's a cat. So what do you think? SpongeBob is a human? Bro, well, SpongeBob? <laughs> yes. Actually, I do think he was a human. I think that Patrick Starr was like a real... It's a hot take. Patrick Starr is a black man. He's a black man. Because he's dumb and more or less lives under a rock? I nice. had no job. Yes. Crazy. Yeah. Keep going, keep going. There's more. Keep going. Make it sound worse. Make it sound worse? Uh, you know. No job. Uh, really dumb. Really dumb. Make, make this worse. Make this uh, worse. He's lazy? Uh, uh, fuck, um, um, yeah, we're gonna get jumped. And on that note, cancel this podcast. Second of all, um, Squidward is like a really annoying, um, just like nerdy dude. He's like he reminds me of a French guy, like a Karen, you know. Mm -hmm. Sandy is a bad bitch for sure. I don't know why. When I was a kid, did you guys go through those phases when you were kids and you really wanted to like sleep with Cartoon Network characters? Oh, 100 percent. Like, do you remember Powerpuff Girls? Oh, all three at the same time. No, 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 but like the oh. mayor. <laughs> Hear me out. Holy Hear me shit. out. The Wait, mayor. Pause. Aren't the Powerpuff Girls like little girls in the show the whole time? Buddy, I'm say saying the mayor. Yesterday, I said one was watching as a kid. <laughs> so the mayor had that one lady that always followed him around. Oh, you could never see I her know head. What you're talking about yeah, the she secretary. was so bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah. bad. I couldn't even see her face. What if she was a fucking truck? I don't know, but she was so bad. Crazy. I wanted a fucking possible. I wanted mm. she go. Mm. Um, it was even a time I watched the um, space. Yeah, do Space Jam. Remember like Lola Bunny? Oh yeah, yeah. Why yeah. the hell was I so into her? That's a rabbit. What am I doing? Bro, our childhoods were fucked up. I used to watch Shrek and see a donkey fuck a dragon and be like, that's normal. <laughs> like, and they had babies and I'm like, yeah, that's, 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 that's normal. Yeah. That's normal. <laughs> Shrek just like turned into a man, went back to being green. We're like, yeah. And you Fiona. I'll do that too. Yeah, Fiona. Yeah. Locked in a, ca a castle for like 10 years, just still alive, it's still hot, has makeup. And I'm like, yeah, it's normal. It's, Someone gets that makes perfect sense. There. Yeah, the dragon's like really hot and fucks a donkey. We're like, well, who, do who, who, do you, who do you guys prefer, Fiona as an ogre or as the princess? Ogre. I'd say princess. I yeah, I like big like green ogre. bitches, huh? <laughs> <laughs> huh? <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> My favorite, dude. That's like, crazy. Fucking pissing me off. What were you saying? Oh, I think you're looking to turn that on. <laughs> the, huh? The light's fucking... All right. What were you saying? <laughs> Sorry, I have ADD. I do have ADD, actually. Uh, what was the next topic of discussion? Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're going to say certain things in our language. And you're going to try and guess what language it is. Okay. Okay. I feel um, like I'd be the better one to do that, but okay. Like literally, but okay. Okay. Uh, we'll take no, 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 it. that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. <laughs> it is our show, right? <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. You didn't invite us to your show. So. My bad. You don't have a show. I, so, should. I really should, actually. You okay, guys so made We're going to converse in our language, and then you're going to guess what language it is, okay? Okay. You ready? Yeah. I said, who's it? And says, it's Saint Clair. I'm Sano and Mano. Mano. Misimo, mihe. Is it Ikon? Ikon ka. Do you know language speaking or no? It's not Hindi. It's not Urdu. 
It's not Tamil. No. You're Sri Lankan. You're Indian. Mm-hmm. So what, Sinhala? Telugu? Garaja, Gujarati? No. No, it's not Gujarati. You're speaking a made-up language then. No. Because no. there is no language you guys would be able to communicate in if you're Sri Lankan and you're Indian. But I Unless, also speak buddy, French. You're the only guy who knows how to learn languages? That's not French. <laughs> No, I know not. it's not French, but I'm saying I also speak French. So <laughs> there could <That's> be funny. <laughs> <laughs> but, oh, the language, yes. Remember the VR? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I don't know what that was. What was that? Okay, well, well, we'll let, we'll keep playing the game, and then uh. we'll, we'll let you know at the end. Like we'll do like a scoreboard, okay? Okay. So you do not. Okay, so do you, can you speak in Tamil or no? Is that Tamil? No, no. I'm asking if you can speak. No, in I know a couple words. Like what? Like something Allah. What? Oh, something Allah. Something Allah. Uh, did you eat? Uh, which is like the, how you say hello? No. It's kind of like a. No, no. That's, did you eat? Yeah, it literally means that, but like it's like a greeting almost. That's Vanakam. Vanakam? Yeah, Vanakam. That's hello. Yeah. No, but like I'm, I was in Dubai and this guy who spoke Tamil was like, when you go to a, like a guy that speaks Tamil, you walk up and say, Tapting Allah. Like, did you eat today? Like, bro, what's up, bro? Yeah, like in Arabic, I, we say, Salam Alaikum, peace be upon you. Yeah, yeah. It literally means peace be upon yeah. you, but it also means yeah. hey. Yeah. Well, you know? yeah. Okay, so say something in So, Tapting Allah? Uh, yeah, Om Sabah done. All right, cool. So, was that Tamil? No, it wasn't Tamil. Who are you guys speaking? Okay, but like I said, we're gonna continue oh, the game. Oh, yeah. so okay, so you you try it now. So just say something in a language, and we're gonna just get to, to myself. It's uh, great. I should have brought. Well, no, you can talk to us, and we'll talk back in English. Oh, okay. Habib, uh, if you can, haja hadiya behi barsha Arabic. Well, yeah, but what was I saying? Oh, wait, no, wait, no, buddy, we're just saying? gonna guess the language. Oh, the le- oh, you want to do what I do on my TikTok? Okay. Um, I'll up the stakes. Okay. I will actually repost you guys when the clips come out. What the fuck? If I'm gonna speak five. <laughs> I'm going to speak five languages and you can get at least what one of them are. Okay. We're start now. What the fuck? Una una flash pack ship it shume bokor. Dua temas os me shume shiptar. Hold on, hold on. Let's play strategically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, wait. Can you tell us can you do all five and then we at once? No, no, no. That's going to be, okay, wait, it's wait, gonna wait, be way harder. Okay, so can you can you okay, go again? Go again. Okay, una flash ship it. Mira dita fala men deret. Dua temas os me shume shiptar. Oof. It's giving European but also Middle Eastern. Yeah, well, like the same. Okay, okay, okay. But we could work with that. So, what's like a European Middle Eastern country? Turkey, kind of, but that's not how Turkish sounds at all. Say it one more time. Yeah. But, no, no, no. It's uh, fucking uh, South American, I think. Sounds a bit like. Uh, no, bro. It'll no? only be Spanish. It's definitely something European. We gotta keep, say something. Keep going, keep going. Like, just keep saying stuff in that language. Uh, you can say the same thing. Okay, I'm gonna say Iranian. See, <laughs> that's Farsi. It comes Mir. out already. That's Farsi. It wouldn't be okay, Iranian. What language do you think it is? It's something European. It's, it's definitely not Arabic. Dutch. It's not Dutch. It's not Dutch. I'm thinking even like like Polish maybe. Keep going. Una flashback shipe. Dua te mesoj me shume shiptar. All right, we'll say Polish. Is it Polish? It's Albanian. Albanian. Ooh. Shipe is Albanian people. Okay. Sheep. No, is Albanian. Shiptar is Albanian. Okay. It's like. Okay. A, it's like. Oh okay, yeah, yeah. Do that. You should when you when you say something like give us like a hint of what it actually is in what okay. you're saying. Okay. So, okay. Okay. So um. Hilcha, Hilnam, Popo, Tadike, Ninoin. Definitely Asian. Say it again. It is Filipino. We got it. Hilnam. Hilcha. I know. Because if I say the other things, it'll be too obvious. It is Filipino. It is Filipino. Like, it's not Filipino. What? No. Okay, go again. Sawadika. Kap kung khao. Kap kung khap. Kap kung khap. Bless you. Kap kung ka. Kap kung khap. Japanese, maybe? Or Vietnamese? No, it's not Vietnamese. I think it's either Japanese or Vietnamese. Bangkok? It's Thai. Thai, okay, okay. That was Thai. It should have given away because I was trying to say it really fast. Pompo Thai DK Ninoin. I speak a little bit of Thai, but I said it like really fast. Okay. Uh, ooh, I like this game. It's another really hard one that you might not get. Because <laughs> I got. I, I'll repost some of these clubs. Kakosi, Shtaima. Huh? Kakosi, Shtaima. Odaklasi. Kakosi, Zovesh? Mui ime Marwan. Kakosi, Zovesh? Odaklasi. Tisi lepa lepita. I'm lost now. First of all, it was Ukrainian. Pricha yeah. malo. Pricha malo. Uh, uchim. Uchim this language. Pricha malo this language. Uchim this language. Russian. No. Was it Ukrainian? No. Italian? It is a derivative of Russian. It's a Slavic language. <clears throat> Three. Two. Icelandic. One. Serbian. 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 <sighs> okay. All right. A papu you say, mira sananika. Posolende, melene marwan. Tikanis. Tikala. Kala. Nekala. 
Ne, Ochi. Ochi. Is it just me or did you just call us the N-word with the hard R? <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> Write down down below what I just said. Tikalis? Hmm? No, Tikanis. Oh. Or Tikanis. To properly say it. Is that, is that the language? No. Tikanis. Tikanis. Tikanis, how are you? Yeah, bro, can you use an easy one? <laughs> it's Greek. Greek. It's Greek. Out of I was going to say Tikanis Malaka. If I said Malaka, you would have gotten it immediately. Well, this so. last one, you guys got to get this right because this is your last one. Uh, <clears throat> <clears throat> Ow. Cheli, cheli sachte, chushkele. Cheli, cheli sachte. Daram yad midiram. That's... Ore? That's Dutch. No. No, fam. That's Arabic. No, is it Arabic? No, it's not. Not in Arabic? No, it's not. Say it one more time. Chatori. Chubi, chatori. Chatori, chushkele. Pedar Sog. Turkish? No, Afghani. No, what do they Armenian? speak? Armenian? It's a language they speak in Afghanistan. Farsi. Uh, no, no, no. Pashtun. Pashtun. Farsi. 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 We got one right. Farsi. 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 Let's fucking go. Farsi. 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 I was going to say, if we don't get any of them right, let's just beat the fuck out. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are what, like 5'3"? Good luck. I'm 6'8". I'm not going to stand up because you guys really will see I am 6'8". Yeah, that was Farsi. Farsi. Um, that's the game that I actually play with people on my TikTok. And it's like a lot of fun because not only do I know like actual languages, like actual languages as if those were fake ones, um, but like like French, Russian, Spanish, like known ones. But I know all these really random ones. Mm. They're like that's like fun to play. Like I'll do Kenya Rwanda. I'll do I'll be like Oh, I know that language too. That's Osa. That's the wrong one. Oh, you're in a Mzungu. What's this one? Mzungu. Hakuna Matata. Asante Mzungu. Hawaiian King? means no Swahili from Swahili Lion King. King. Yeah, that's Swahili. They're speaking oh, Lion King. Sw Swahili. Yeah, Tanzania is technically where they the were. The name of Amazing. the king is Mufasa. Mufasa. That's not how the song goes. You know, the Lion King is based off Hamlet. Really? I had no idea. I used to love him. I'm a big nerd when it comes to like history books and stuff like that. Like it, it was Hamlet. I had no idea. Okay, question: Since you're a historian, who would win in a fight, Bin Laden or um, <laughs> or Adolf this. Hitler? What do they got? Their own actual armies? No, no, just them. Like one on one. One on one. Oh, Bin Laden was six three. Hitler <laughs> was like six, seven. Five. Bin Laden? <laughs> oh yeah, he's well, he's Hitler's fuck. Answer your own question. Oh okay, I, I didn't. He's Arab. He'll just explode if he loses. <laughs> <laughs> What's Hitler gonna go like that in his eye? Like, oh, come on, bro. Holy fuck! Come on, bro. Come on, bro. bro. Cancel this guy. Cancel Can't, this you guys guy. told me to be as. Before we got started, they go be as racist as possible. <laughs> we did not That's say literally that. what we do on this podcast. And I go, I bet. Wait, okay, so this is the part where you're going to say the N-word with the hard E-R. Okay. So one, two, three. Why do you censor me? Why do you... Why are you censoring me every time? Stop censoring me, bro. What's wrong with you? I'm not that dumb. Come on. <laughs> not Should we do that. the final four? Yeah, let's run to the final What's four. Final four? As much as I want to keep fucking around this guy. <laughs> What's the final four? The final four than the four black dudes coming. <laughs> oh. <laughs> we'll okay. sponsor and we're just going to watch you uh, do magic. I can find... I'll just speak to the uh, Nigerian. I do speak Yoruba. Okay. And I might get I'd be like, Mosu Yoruba, uh -uh. What are you doing, boy? What, 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 what are you talking about? Why are you being over here, being a delinquent? You're being a very strange guy. You're bringing me to a room. I was waiting outside. I was worried I'm going to get trafficked. <laughs> because there was a car that came in with the water. And they were saying, oh, this guy, he's a white shirt. He's waiting for two brown guys to come in the room. And he's going to make a podcast with them. <laughs> well, 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 who makes a podcast in Miami? You're being a delinquent. Crazy. You are being a strange guy. You're you're acting like you are you are a Nigerian guy. You're not even buying the Jordan shoes. You're buying Jesus instead. Do you believe in God? Of course. Okay. Of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs> what what? They always go like what 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 what? Like they have to like it's like when you watch like Scooby Doo running, he like, yeah, like loads up ready. the run <laughs> and he goes. It's like no, they do that when they talk. It's like an old car. You gotta start it up. What 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 do you mean? You are being a weird guy. You are being a delinquent. I love saying delinquent. A delinquent. It's, it's such a fun fucking word. They say it like it's like a whole sentence. You are being a delinquent. I think that is a sentence. No, okay. <laughs> I don't even know English that well, guys. Crazy, crazy. Okay, Anyways, final, final, final four. four. So, <clears throat> four questions, rapid fire, first thing that comes to your head. First one, if you had to swap lives with someone for 24 hours. What? No, actually, I couldn't hear if you. If you had to swap lives with someone for 24 hours, who would you pick? Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo? Yeah. Messi's better. No, Ronaldo, the one homeless guy outside. Yes, Cristiano Ronaldo. <laughs> Messi's not better. Yeah, he is. No, he's not. Well, he is. Better team. Well, what team was better? Argentina versus Portugal. 
You're going to say that Argentina isn't stacked with legends and Portugal is. Portugal has like five known guys. Argentina, every single motherfucker plays on Europa League. The, bro, Argentina has... Okay, you know, honestly, bro, this is not... The That's what I was going to say, because I'll lose. Huh? I'll lose. <laughs> okay. Because I'm technically wrong. Everyone knows Messi's better, but I love Ronaldo. Fair. Don't convince me otherwise. Next question. <sighs> Who would you say is the most <laughs> motivational person of all time? Hannibal Barca. Who, sorry, who's who? this? Hannibal Barca. The guy that led the Carthaginian army against the Roman Empire and took all the elephants over the Alps. And he made the phrase, if there is not a way, I will make one. He's also like the world's greatest military tactician that existed in the third century BC that people now in military school still learn about. And he's also Tunisian. W. Okay. Yeah. Let's w just say guy. your whole life from the day you were born till now is written in a book. What would the title of that book be called? Him. I'm just kidding. Uh, what would it be called? That would have been kind of cool. Yeah, right. What would it be called? It would be <clears throat> my whole entire life. How would it become a jack of all trades? Mm, master of none? I think that's what it would be. Okay. Last G final question. Oh, sorry. I, didn't mean to I forgot. Off. What? Last final question. If today was your dying message to the world, what would your final message be? A dying message to the world, what would it be? It's going to sound so cheesy, but it's Miley Cyrus says it. Life really is what you make it. Like everything, like, and, and this is like a, my mantra. My mantra is against all odds, here I am. Because against all odds, you can make things happen if you truly believe you can make it happen. Like you are the chooser of your destiny. No matter what, like I'm a dude that came from nothing. And now I like have all this, right? But I, literally I came from nothing. I come from a country that doesn't have much. A country that has a whole world plethora of history that no one even thinks about or remembers but like I, I i firmly believe that you can do it if you try it's all about effort like life is what you make of it this podcast happened because you guys tried i love all these languages because i tried if i didn't try i hate people that don't try because people are afraid of trying fucking pussies. And like it's, it's honestly fucking pussies bro regret to me is my biggest fear God. you know and 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 they what's that one guy nf uh he's the singer the rapper oh andrew tate yes no he goes, my big, my greatest regret in life is knowing that I never tried. Mm. Like facts, bro. Like you have to try. If you don't try, you'll never make it. And it's gonna be hard to try. It's like ripping a fucking bandit off on your hair is me. You know, it's by this point, the electric chair already you're already gone. Oh, facts. Oh, yeah. wait, yeah. I don't couldn't I just say a last thing to the I'd probably do a whole monologue that let me still live. I talk a lot. I'm a talker. Oh, we've seen that. Yeah, you can't tell I go. <laughs> we've seen that. There's so many funny stories I tell you guys off camera, but you know it's God. I can't give you guys all that content. What's your best much. joke as before I wrap it up? Your my best, best joke, joke? Yeah. my life uh, no laugh it's crazy um oh it's it's i'm a nerd it's not really a joke but it's just a funny fucking story okay okay again i'm a history nerd sure. did you know that 45 percent of the population in the 14th century died because one guy was afraid of cats what did what? you know that pope urban pope urban in the 13th century do you guys remember the plague yes yeah. so this dude was like oh I'm the Pope. I decree everything that there is to know about society. Everyone has to follow me because all of Europe was super like Christian at the time. And mm -hmm. he was like the messenger. He was like a, a figment of God, like an enigma of God. And he goes, cats are Satan. Cats are the devil. So kill every cat you see. So they killed all the cats that they saw for like a year. And then guess what happened? All these rats that had the plague came to Europe and it spread like wildfire because there were what? no natural predators of the rats because they were all killed by the Pope. What? Yeah. It's like, it's like, what the fuck? <laughs> it's not really a joke. It's just like the most funny fucking thing I've ever thought about. What the fuck? He was deathly so afraid of cats and it caused half of Europe to die. You think population control was a thing back then too? 100%. It, it definitely was. And then it was, of course, repopulated by Genghis Khan a couple of centuries later. And he fucked everyone. What a legend, um, eh? Wild story, by the way. I one day. Huh? I said I want to live up to my grandfather one day. Genghis Khan? Yeah. Or Bin Laden. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Definitely not been long, bro. He's six seven. He's like five three. How's that even? Do you guys know how tall they are on the podcast? By the way, they're both five feet tall, and like they're sitting down, but they're standing. You just can't see the bottom of the floor. Yeah. I'm actually jumping right now, and I'm just floating midair. That's why I'm this tall. Yeah, but just, all right, guys. Just wait till we fuck you in a bit. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, right? <laughs> so many sex jokes. Do you guys? Then, then wait, wait, wait. Show you how short la we are. Last question. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> last question. I got. How long have I been in Miami for? Like uh, a couple of days five, now. Five, have you guys met up with any birds yet? A couple. How's it been? Sorry? How's it been? Phenomenal. Where were they from? Miami. Where'd you meet them? Miami. What'd you do with them? We did this with them. Where are their bodies? <laughs> Where are their bodies? Well, the crazy part is, uh, we don't have a podcast. 
This is just a front. Really? This is all just. This is the human trafficking ring. You ever see like one meme? <laughs> You remind door. me of this one. No, this is one fucking Buddy, TikTok. Nothing's fucking plugged in right now. I can tell that lights <laughs> is a fucking like all these lights, all this is just fit. Who are these guys? That's not even you. That's fucking Andrew Tate and Drake. What's going on? Wait, you're, who's Drake? You're, you're, you're you got a beard. You're, you're, Yo, I have an idea. Let's fucking end this episode. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Right. I bored them enough for an hour, for about an hour and twenty minutes. I'm that boring. I'm sorry. Holy. <laughs> No, no, no. <laughs> all right, guys, yeah. we're going to put all of Merwan's links in the description below. You definitely don't want to check out his stop. <laughs> definitely don't check out his course. You don't want to learn any languages. It's a useless skill. Don't follow me. Don't talk um, to me, if you're, especially if you're hot. Don't do it. And if this guy doesn't repost a single post of oh, ours, we're going to come back and We're going to come back to Miami. Yeah, I wouldn't even be threatened guy. by two little brown guys. In the rest. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, I'm scared. I live in Miami. <laughs> He's going to bomb you. That's fine. I made the bomb. Crazy. But that wraps up the video, right, guys. guys. Until next time, remember, stay seeking success. Boom. <laughs>